we pick up this first down, we're, we're kneeing this thing out the rest of the way with a minute 26. Need another big catch from someone. Take the snap, and they're going to keep it with Moore. Moore's got running room out of the side, and he's got breaking it out to the 40. 30, forget the first down. Moore's going to run. Football season is underway, and with a big win at Briarcrest, D.C. football moves to 2-1 and one on the season. Last week against Briarcrest, the um, win, it meant a lot to us. We just had to lock in, like Coach Ford told us, in the second half, and just keep suffocating. Briarcrest scored on the opening drive of the game. Torian Davis got an interception that set up a short field, and Cameron Taylor found the end zone from a yard out. But the point after attempt was no good, so D.C. trailed early 6-7. The Saints scored again, but their point after attempt was blocked by Jalen Spikes. At the end of the first quarter, D.C. trailed 6-13. Early in the second quarter, Andrew Moore connected with Ethan Miner for a gain of over 60 yards. A fourth down quarter keeper and PAT ties the game at 13. Briarcrest scored again to take a 2013 lead. The Jags defense was able to force another turnover and Cameron Taylor ran in for his second touchdown of the night to tie the game again 2020. With five seconds remaining in the first half, Miner scored again to give D.C. a 27-20 lead. Halfway through the third quarter, D.J. Daniels forces a turnover and scored a defensive touchdown. Brad Crest gets a touchdown on a big pass completion to cut the Jaguars' lead to eight. Cameron Taylor finds the end zone for a third time to give D.C. a 40-26 lead. The same Saints scored in the fourth and quarter and had a successful two-points conversion to bring the game to a one-possession game. Andrew Moore has a 50-yard run to extend the lead to a two-score game again. Defense played really, really well. Uh, quarterback Andrew, he also played really well, really well. Also as the receivers, so they got us a good, um, good lead with the offense, and so we just did pretty good in this. The Jaguars' defense forced seven turnovers in the game, and the offense made some big plays to defeat Briarcrest 46-34. D.C. hosts Grenada tonight. The theme is neon. I'm Sarah with Jag TV.